I was working in the intensive care unit. So I did some flight nursing, and, and but mostly intensive care. I was taking care of a patient named Amy. She had leukemia. I reached out to her family and was just like, you know, you've got to decorate this room. Two days later, her room was just plastered with her artwork. When she lost her battle, um, the nurses really took it hard and said, well, we've got to figure out a way for us to have a little bit of closure and for us to honor Amy. We signed up for this random art class. It was, it was such a fun night and I was like, well, I'm really enjoying this. And so then I just started painting. When I first started painting and I would do sort of these soothing paintings of like soothing landscapes and colors, Making art has been so healing and soothing for me as a person. And it sounds woo-woo, but I manifested, like, I'm gonna get a studio and it's gonna be beautiful. And then it was a beautiful day in Carmel and I was dropping artwork off at a, a little boutique that I was showing at and I was like, I'll just go by and see it. And it had the most gorgeous ocean view. I was just standing there with my mouth open, like, I can't believe I'm getting this opportunity. Like, this is more than I could possibly have dreamed of. So I want to be able to um, bring some sort of a program to nurses that helps them heal and find the gift that I found. And so that's out there in the universe, and I don't know what that's gonna look like, but um, I'm gonna figure it out how to share that because it's, you know, it's brought so much joy and healing into my life. Like, you have to share that stuff. I've got more of a purpose.